Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. Yeah, now we've got our 90 degree weather for the next week, but the sun is out. No more storms in sight for us anyway. Thank goodness. I hope you guys have all recovered power back on and I hope you're ready to do some work today. We're going to focus um, today on single arm to double arm lift. So right, left, and then both. We're going to focus on that. We're going to focus on light to mid range weight. We'll do a little bit of heavier weight stuff when we get to the, uh, we're going to do lat pulls today on the floor. So we'll be heavyweight for that. If you don't have heavyweight at home, use two weights that you have, two of your heaviest weights that you have. So if you have like 10 pound weights, use both of those for one, one um, lat pull, okay? And thanks, I know, yay. I'm so happy that you can join me today and I hope it's cool in your house because we ain't doing this outside today. Let me just say that. A friend of mine that lives in Cedar Rapids ran nine miles today and she said, that was before noon and she goes, I can't take it anymore. And she had to go in. <laughs> I truly believe that. So you guys, let's get started. I'm gonna start the music. We're gonna do a little stretching. Make sure you have your light weights and get some heavy weight for lap pulls. We are gonna get it going. Let's do it. Here's our music. There it goes. All right, I hope you're ready. And I hope you're gonna have some fun with me today. Let's do it, let's do it. Roll your shoulders back, roll. Keep rolling back now, big arm rolls back. All right, let's reverse, just roll, big circles. There you go. Now, forward and back, make sure you squeeze your back there a little bit. All right, so forward and back. Good, good. Open up everything up wide. Press down, pull. Carrie, you good? Woo! All right. Take it on the cross. What do we got? I love I turned my comments on. Kiko's here. All right, Kiko's in. I love it, girls. I love it. Come on up, tricep. Now, switch arms, tricep. And let's take this one under. We had pizza last night, so you're not gonna work hard today. It was good though. Thin crust, Papa Murphy's pizza with uh, spinach, feta cheese, pepperoni. It was so good. It was so good. Come around front. Round your upper back. Who's this? Good. Kurt's on. I'm glad I turned the notifications on. I see you guys. Awesome. Roll one side. Pull your arm. Roll the other side, pull your arm. Stretch those lats, you guys. Back to the middle, and we're going straight to the top. All right, forearms to your thighs. Come on down, flatten out your back. Give me a nice flat yoga back here. Lift your chest, not your chin, right? So neck in line. Awesome. All right, round yourself all the way to the floor. Push your hips up. I'm going to turn the music down just a little bit. Push your hips up. All right. <laughs> I just had to turn it down. Go to your right foot. Let's go all the way down to the right leg. Come on down. Push your hips up and back. And go the other direction. Push those hips up and back. All right. Back to the middle. Kind of roll. One vertebra at a time. Just roll. Does that feel good? I know how it does. All right. Take your... Hand up, pull your fingers back. Watch through here, so pull everything back. Woo. Awesome. Hope you guys have had a great weekend. Make this pull down. I know uh, we finally got um, our big, huge branches that came up our tree. Finally got those uh, chainsaws so we can get them out of the backyard now. Flip it over. Nothing like Cedar Rapids, that's for sure. Nothing like down in the middle of Iowa City either. So we we got us pretty lucky. All right, other hand. Up, pull. Awesome. Okay, so your thumb. Now make a fist. Come on down. Stretch forms, wrists. That's what we're doing here. Awesome. Hand over. Feels 
great, yeah? Okay, shoulder roll, and let's get started. I want you to grab uh, grab a light set of weights and grab a mid-range set of weights, like a set higher than that. We're gonna work one arm, one arm both, and the other arm, like one, two, and then both together. So I want you guys to get all the weights that, that you have handy that are shoulder level weights, all right? I'm gonna start with six. And they kind of match my top. I think that's, you know, I like that, right? Match, I was shopping in my closet yours and I found this top from a long time ago. I like it. All right, feet under hips, bend your legs, palms down, right arm, then lift left arm, then both arms together. Here we go, right? Chest level, left, both, do it again. Up, down, up, down, both arms, up and down. Lock your abs, you know the rules. Lock your abs really tight, bend your legs. Right, left, both. Is it feeling pretty good so far? It's just a warm up. Make sure your shoulders are back and down away from your jaw. Right, left, and both. Carrie said she wanted me to work y'all hard today. That means I gotta work me hard too, come on. Take it right, left, and both. Go again. Left. And both. Keep on, keep on trucking. Come on, right? Left. Both up. Right. Left. Are you starting to feel a little warmth in there? That's what I want. You got four more reps. Now we got three more reps. Up, both arms. Keep those legs bent, keep those abs tight. One more, one more. Now both, arms up, row your shoulders. All right, now, we're gonna take them to the side, but we're going both arms, thumbs up, out to the side, shoulders back and down, let's go, both arms. Armpit level only, up and down. Now we're doing this because in a minute, do one of each. Good. Good, five to go, five, four, three, two more guys. Last one, last one. All right, now that should have warmed up your shoulders. Now I want you to do one thumbs up to the front while you do one thumbs up to the side. All right, roll your shoulders around, back and down, bend your legs, reset your abs, and let's go. Now switch. Good, we're gonna go opposite, and then we're gonna switch. Keep it up. These are both thumbs up. Abs are tight now. This might be feeling like it's getting a little heavy, right? Because it is. It's the same weight, you haven't changed your weight level, but it's getting heavier. Good. Good, 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 keep going. Four more each direction, you guys. Here we go. Three more each direction. Oh, it's getting really heavy feeling. Good. I like that. Woo! Here's your last one already. All right. Roll your shoulders. Now, I want you to go up and wait just a pound or two if you have that weight handy. Just a pound or two if you have that weight handy. All right? Adjust your bridges, whatever you need to adjust, your clothes. Shoulder roll. We're starting a little bit heavier. I just went up two pounds. Now, if you want to take a toe back, do, but we're going out with our elbows. So what I want you to do is make sure your elbows are not down. Make sure your elbows are not forward. Hold them back. Do you feel a squeeze in the middle of your upper back? I'll speed back. All right, we're going right arm, left arm, then both. Here we go. Right, left, and then both arms up and down. Watch, not drop below your shoulder level. Woo, yeah. Both arms. There's right, left, squeeze it together, pull it back apart. Right, left, squeeze both together. Bend those legs. 
One foot back if you need it. Lock your abs tighter than ever now. Come on. Up, down, up, down. Both arms. Good. Breathe. You have four more reps just like this to do. Let's start now. Here we go. Up, up, both arms. Three more reps. Yeah, baby. Both arms. Is this starting to really burn, really feel heavy? Woo! Two more reps. One more rep. Here's right. Left. Both arms, now stop. Give me an eight bottom half. Eight, seven, six, come on. Keep it chin level, four. Bring it down easy. Oh my God, I wanted that to burn and I think we accomplished our task. Ah, shake it off. Water, you must get water. Water is not an option. Woo. Neither is my little cooling off fan, baby. Oh yes. All right, that was burning, that was burning a lot. Roll your shoulders back. We're going down for chest, all right? Let's go down to the mat for chest. So grab your mat, bench, whatever you're using for chest. I want you to grab a, a mid-range and a heavy. You don't need to worry about lightweight today for, for the chest. We're gonna do chest press, mid-range and heavy. So that heavy weight level, you're gonna use for the chest press and only for the lat pulls, and then we're going back to light and mid-range. So we need mid-range and heavy, two sets of weights. Let's get down to the floor. All right. Oh, I'm gonna use 15 and 12. I don't know about y'all, but that's gonna be, our, I'm sorry, 15 and 20. That's gonna be mine. Oh. We're gonna start with the mid-range weight, and then we're gonna go to the heavy weight after that. So, get one of each beside you on the floor. Put the weights up like this before you roll down, and then come on down. All right, tuck your hips up and under so your low back is down and brace on that floor, all right? Woo. Take the weights to the top. Now, these are end to end, okay? I want these end to end. Shoulders away from your jaw. Push them over your bra line. Yeah, even the guys, you know where that is. All right, pull your arms apart. Elbows come down. Front arm, back arm, then both. Front, back, both arms, up and down. Let's go. Front arm, back arm, both arms. Squeeze your abs. Use those abs, you guys. Use the abs. Squeeze your chest together there, right there. You feel it? Now use the abs here. Use them always. Squeeze, don't let the abs, don't let your back arch off that floor. Back, both arms. Keep your shoulders down away from your jaw. Both arms, woo! Let's go up, up, both arms. Front, is it feeling heavy? Woo! Come on, keep it up. This is just your mid-range weight, guys. Yeah. Let's go up, down, up, down. Both arms. Go for it. You're almost there. You got five to go. Let's do it. Both arms. Let's go up and down. Oh yeah, you guys, come on, almost there. Woo. Two more reps. Let's go. Front arm, back arm, don't switch weight yet. You can do this. Come on, so your mid-range weight, this is the last rep. All right, stop, bring your elbows in, slowly sit up. Don't tell me that did not burn. I know it did. Shake your hands out. Go to your heavy set of weights, all right? We don't have very many reps to do with the heavy weights. Just eight, that's it, eight reps. All right, but we're gonna do the same thing we just did. So, get ready for it. And 
I want you to not switch weight levels unless you cannot push the weight up. That's called muscle failure, and that's the only time that you should switch weight now. Unless, if you have something that hurts, just stop and use no weight. Figure out why it hurts, let me know, and we'll figure out what it is. I'll give you some physical therapy stuff to do, all right? Come on down. Roll your hips up, push the weights up. Oh, these 20 pounders, they feel heavy right now. All right, so we're right over that, that bra line, that mid chest line, and I gotta slide my weight. Oh, here we go. All right, so pull your arms down, and let's go front arm, back arm, and then both. Here we go. Front, back, and both, and down. Front, keep going, are you good? Yeah, girl, come on. Both arms. Here's your halfway point, guys. This is number four. I know, already, right? You got four reps to go, that's it. Up, down, up, down. Both, use your abs, use your chest, not your shoulders. Two more reps. Woo. Both arms. One more rep, one more rep, come on, come on, push. You gotta use your Oh, bring them in, sit up. I know, that was hard, that was heavy, right? Shake your fingers out, open your chest. Come on, open up, stretch it out. Oh man, oh man, guys. Woo. All right, grab a drink of water, if it's handy. And we're gonna stay on the floor. We're gonna start our back work with lat pulls. So you want heavy and heavier, right? So I don't know what weight you have at home. Curtis, get the heaviest weight you can stand for a lat pull. You just need one super heavy weight and one weight that's even heavier. So we've got, we've got up to 45 over there, but I'm not gonna pull it off the rack. You know what'll happen, I'll drop it on my foot. More likely. If it was on the floor, it'd be better. All right, so I'll go 20 and 25, because that's what I have right handy with me right here. I'm gonna do that. Whew. We're gonna start with the lighter of those two weight levels, all right? Positioning, roll yourself down. You're gonna hold your weight like this, around the hammer end. Now watch my arms. We're gonna start over the chest, lock your abs in, and we're gonna pull overhead straight arms. You're not gonna bend your elbows, all right? This is not triceps. Bend your elbows, don't do it, right? Start here, long arms, and pull straight back over your chest. Now what's gonna happen is you're gonna feel like your back's gonna to wanna to pull you off the floor. Don't do that. Pull it down, do not lift your back off the floor. So your arms are straight, both directions. All right, let's get it to the top. Lighter of the two weights. Hips up, and let's take off. Here we go. Take it back, two, back over the chest. Two, let's go. Roll those hips up. Take it back. Take it over. Ew, this feels really good on my back. Oh, and my abs, mix my abs up really hard. Oh, come on, Carrie. Oh, baby, come on, back. Two, over, two. Keep it up, guys. Take it back, and over. Molly, come on, girl, are you in? You're gonna give me six more reps with this weight. Not five. Lock those abs. Four. Uh, three. Two more with this weight level. Last one, last one. Stop here, easy down with the weight. Grab it around the stem, thumb down, then just flip it up as you sit up. Oh man, is it good? All right, we're going heavier, but we're gonna do same amount of reps. Heavy, heavy, heavy. I don't care how heavy you go, but you gotta go heavier than what you just did, all right? Even if you have to grab two of a lighter set, okay? Let's do it. Grab it around the bow, around the stem. All right, roll your hips up. Get that low back on that floor, guys. Feet on the floor. Push it up over your chest. 
All right, here we go. We're going back, two, and over the chest. Good, keep going. Lock your abs in super tight right there, because if it's heavier, you know you're going to feel that back want to lift. So don't let it, keep it tight. Long arms, long arms, no bend. Woo! Back, two, over, two. Let's keep going. You got seven to go. All right, go. Six. Lock it up, guys. Lock it up. Got five left. You got four left. Three more, baby. Both. Right. Left. 
both. Good. Woo. Squeeze your back here. Squeeze it. Come on, six more. Right. Left. Both. Right. Left. Come on, breathe. Both. Come on, you can finish. Come on, finish. You have two more reps to go. Do them. Do them. One left. Both. Arms and done. Set them down. Oh, I'm going to set them over here. All right. Listen, shake everything off. Let's go up. What time is it? We got plenty of time. I know you're so lucky. All right, we're going up in weight. Take a little break, bring uh, bring the water on. Doesn't matter, you need it, drink it, right? Woo. I'm gonna go up two pounds. We're doing less reps. Same thing, all right, here we go. All right, guys. Starting with your wide row, shoulders. Anytime you need a break, take one, and all you gotta do is breathe and drink water and reset to go, all right? Here we go, right arm wide row, left arm wide row, both arms up and down, let's go. Out, both arms, up, up, both, lock those abs. Halfway there on this one. Keep going. Almost there, three more. Good, two to go, two to go, two reps. Yep, one rep, the single arm, single arm, double arm. That's right. Here it is, last one of these. All right, stand up, reset. Woo. All right, remember to bend. Use those quads, use those abs. Tilt, looking over the cliff, shoulders around, back and down. Right arm, left arm, straight back. Right, left, both, and down. Right, squeeze hard. Left, both, right, left, and both. Keep it up, keep it up. Right, left. Squeeze your back, guys, squeeze it. Woo! Come on. Right, left. I want four more reps out of you guys. Come on. Breathe. Three to go. Oh, I know. It's burning back there. Ugh. Two more. Last one. Stop. Set them down. I'm going to set them over here. Shake it off. Like Taylor Swift says, shake it off, shake it off. Do it, shake your hands, wiggle your fingers. Pull up your pants, do get water. Sometimes you gotta adjust your clothes after something like that. Woo! So, I hope you're feeling great. Oh baby, cause it's time. It's time to stretch a little bit and go for triceps. Triceps and biceps, guys, and we're going to core. Does that sound great? Do you like the one arm, one arm, both arm stuff? I personally like it because it makes your heart rate go up so quick. Hug yourself and it gives you lots of muscle definition, which is what you're looking for, right? Come on, strength, muscle definition. Oh yeah, all of it. All right, get your light and your mid range, meet me on the map. We're gonna do some tricep, one arm, one arm, both arm. All right, I gotta move some stuff out of the way here. Oh yeah, baby. I don't want to use those, but I do want to use these. All right, put one of each weight level on either side of your mat. We're going to do the same thing. One arm, other arm, both arms. It's that simple. And uh, it's not really simple, is it? Let's start with the heavy, heavier weight. So pick up your mid-range weight. Roll it down, tuck your abs. Oh yeah. Feel your back on the floor. It kind of feels good, doesn't it? 
Bring your weights right into your ribs. All right? First of all, we're just going to start with a little push up, up. A little halfway push. I'm going to get everything warmed up. Lock your abs in. All right, keep going. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Now listen, one arm and then the other. So you're going all the way up front, all the way back, both arms up and down. Here we go. Front, back, both arms, lock your abs, come on. Front, don't speed up. Don't have your weight, you better pay attention to your body. All right, front arm up, back arm up, both arms. Front, back, both and down, front, back. Both and down. Four more. Make sure you're breathing. Three more. Oh, is that getting heavy? <laughs> Woo! This is it. Stop at the bottom. Bottom half, both arms go up, up. Just the bottom abs. I want you to really feel this work. Use your abs. Get it out of your shoulders, you guys. Come on. You got eight, seven, six, oh, four, three, two, one. Push it all the way up. Oh, it's getting hard to push it up, wasn't it? Come on down, sit up. All right, we're going to the lighter set of weights, you guys. Get those mid-range out of your way. Woo! Pick up your lighter set of weight because here comes some fun, baby. All right, roll down. Lock those abs in. Pull your arms right into your sides. All right, we're gonna go full range of motion, both arms to start. So we're going up and down, up and down. Keep going. Use the, use the arms, use the abs. There's four, three. Do you feel your shirt brushing the inside of your arms? Give me top. All right, look up. You're gonna go one arm down 90, other arm down 90, then both arms down, two, up, two. Let's go, front arm down, up, back arm down, up, both arms. Only 90 degrees here. All right, pay attention to how low you're going because if you're feeling your elbow joint or your elbow tendon, you've gone too far. Now, squeeze your elbows in together. Squeeze the elbows. Have them facing directly at your knees. You're gonna go front arm, up. Back arm, down, two, up, two. That's it. Front, back, both slower. Do not move your shoulders, you guys. Don't move your shoulders. If you're starting to move your shoulders, reset. Reset your body. I want your shoulders to remain in one spot the whole time. Well, the heart, I just saw something fly, like a big fly or something. What the hell is that? Both arms. Four more reps, you can do it, come on. Down, up, down, up, both arms. Oh, lock it in, guys, three to go. Three doesn't sound like very many, because now it's at two. Let's go. Down, up, down, up, both arms, and up. Here it is, last one. Both arms. Stop at the top, bring it to the bottom, bottom halves. Here we go, here we go. We are not neglecting our triceps today, not whatsoever. Stay here, stay here, you got 12. Open up, switch elbows. 
down. Yeah, I've got 10. I don't know what you guys are using. I'm using 10s. Give me one more rep. Bottom, bottom, all the way up and down. All right, roll your shoulders. Keep your weights in your hands. Woo! All right, both arms, light weights, up and down, hammers to palms. So we're going hammers, twist to palms, twist back to hammers. Let's go. Up, up, down, down. Stopping at your chest, stopping at your legs. Do not swing your weights when you get here, but I want your arms to be fully up, two, down, two. Give me five more reps. You can do it. Yes, you can. Woo! Two more. Breathe. Use your yoga breathing. It'll work. All right, put them down. Woo, you guys. Mind feel numb. Wiggle your fingers, open it up. Take your thumbs down, pull back, stretch your biceps. Pull back, lace your finger, pull out. Like that, right? If you can. Woo, baby, shoulder roll. Now, I hope you like that because that's just something different that we gotta do to mix it up to get muscle engagement, building strength, building muscle. Now it is time for core work. I gotta get a quick drink. Oh, Ooh. Cindy, Cindy, you gotta get on here more often, doll face. Whoa. Cindy Loftinsky, she's so sweet. I love her. Get a lightweight. I think I'm gonna get a six or an eight. I'll get one of each. Let's see, I've got a six here and an eight here. All right. Meet me on the mat. We're down. Woo! First of all, I want to start on our back, right? So we don't have to use our arms yet. Let's start on your back. So put your head to the right. Put your head to the right. All right. Look at my weights are in the way. I gotta kick them. Oh well. Grab your light weight. I'm gonna grab my eight pound weight. All right. Hold it up over your chest. I want you to bring your legs up at 90 degrees. I want you to watch. Watch first. All right, we're gonna go front leg, back leg. Now watch both legs and crunch. All right, I'll call it out, but I want you to keep your knees over your hip and your shins parallel to the floor so you keep the low abs engaged, right? We're keeping the low abs engaged by doing that. Once you drop your heels or pull your knees in, you've lost your low ab engagement. Get it 90 degrees. Wait up. Front leg, back leg, both legs. Here we go. No crunch with the upper until the end. Here we go. Front leg, back leg, both legs, crunch up. Front leg, knee over hip, back leg, both feet, and crunch up here. Front leg, back leg, both legs, out, and here's your crunch. Do it again. Front leg. Back leg, keep the knee over the hip. Stop here and start again. Front, back, both, and in. Rebecca, you can use this move. Your, your clients will love it. Rebecca's a personal trainer in Wales. You, your clients will love this at Rebecca. <laughs> they'll, they'll hate it, which means they'll love it, right? Out and in. One leg at a time, then both. Woo. Here we go. Out. Out. You got one more rep after this one. Here's your last rep. Front leg. Back leg. Both feet. Crunch. Now hold it here. Put your feet up and push your chest towards your shoelaces. Not your arms, your chest. Let's go. Up. 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 You're pushing your chest. Not your your arms, not your arms. Eight, seven, six. There's four, three, two, one. Now everything slow to the bottom. Slow. Four, three, two, one. And put your feet down. Ditch your weight. Woo! 
flip over. We're gonna hover, guys. Forearms. Forearms, these are toes. I'll go sideways so you can see what's going on. So put your head towards the right, your feet towards the left. All right, here we go. Oh, man. All right, start on your knees. Make sure that you're on your forearms and not your elbows. Make sure you're not here, right? Keep your butt right here. Now, curl your toes under, squeeze your knees up into the back of your leg, and push your heels back. How's that feel? Hold on for a sec, we're not done. You're gonna walk front leg, back leg, both legs, out, in. Front, back, both legs, out, in. On the knees, it's the same thing. Both legs, out, in. Front leg, back leg. Use that core. Use that core, front leg. Back leg, both feet. Front leg, back leg, both legs. Four more reps, here we go. Out, out, both legs. Three more. Two more. Here it is. Last one. Drop. Sit back. Stretch for a sec. Woo. Now, we got to do a little bit more with the taps. All right? We're going to plank shoulder taps. <laughs> but we're not going to do both unless you know how to do a flyover. All right? Don't worry about it. We're not going to do it. It's not easy to catch yourself unless you know what you're doing, right? So let's go to plank instead of hover. Hands, knees or toes. If you're on your knees, it's actually harder to do on your knees, right? Try both. Squeeze your knees up into the back of your leg. Get your feet wider than your hips. All right, we're gonna tap right to right. Right to left, left to right, keep going. Keep your feet wide, keep your knees, squeeze your knees, come on. Try not to rock and roll. Don't twist your body, stay solid. Your chest, your hips, solid. Square to the floor. Come on, eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, feel that core work. Four, three, two, one. Walk it down and drop your knees. Woo! Raise your hand if you're ready to stretch. Miss Price, I'm ready. Okay, let's do it. Sit back in the child's pose. Long arms, heels back, hips back. Drop your forehead. Oh yeah. Woo! Just breathe. I want you to calm down your breath right here. All right. Take your left hand back slightly. Take your right arm across to the left side so your hands are in line. Push the right side of your body over and out. Dropping the armpit. Come on, push it out. Stretch those lats. Oh, feels good. Now I just want you to bend this elbow, put your fingertips on your back, and press down into that floor. Take some deep breaths. Woo. There's that bug. Oh man, dead, it's dead now. The one that flew by me, right? Take your hand back on the right, take your left arm over to the right, Push the left side of your body over and out to the left. Woo! Sit back and down. Push the side of your body way over. Try to get your armpit to come down so you can stretch those lats. Woo! Now bend your elbow. Put your fingertips on your back. Press triceps down to the floor. Oh. 
All right, come on up to all fours. Give yourself a nice cat stretch. Just take a breath. Exhale. Now inhale and, and drop your back with your chest. Cow stretch, not your head, just your chest. And as you exhale, round it again. Roll your back, you guys. Roll your back. I don't care what stretching you like out. Just roll your back. Grab your knees. And I want you to rock and roll a couple times both directions. Woo! Nice. Now extend your front leg. Pull your back knee in. Woo! And just pull it across. So we've got a nice stretch in the hips. Oblique, slow back right here. Stretch it out. See if you can get your back shoulder on that floor. And you can even look that direction. Alright, lock that ankle over. Pull everything in. And if this doesn't feel quite right, you can leg away from you. And that will lengthen the whole side of your body on that side. Alright, from the back. All right, so now I want you to take the other leg up and just drop it. Pull the front knee in, feel that stretch happening, and then pull the knee across. Keep your back arm on the floor if you can. Go wherever you can go and keep that back arm on the floor. Just take some breaths. All right, feels great. Now lock that ankle over, come to the middle, and once again you can either push it away, stretching the back side, which I really like this stretch, I can feel the lengthening of that side of my back and hip, or you can pull through, keep your upper body down and relax, and just take some breath, oh, so good, yes? Oh, let's get up to the top, okay? So come up to a downward facing dog. So hands, curl your toes under, lift your hips, and press your palms down to the floor as you push yourself back. Heels down, if you can do it. Then walk those hands back to your feet. Stretch here. Feel the stretch right here, long stretch. Take a slow roll up when you're ready. Woo. All right, take a shoulder, right shoulder. Take it under and across, drop shoulder. Put your arm across, palm is up. Feel free to rotate your palm up and down. It'll move the stretch around for you, right? Pull it in. Good. Take it up a little more tricep. As we do this, we're gonna pull over. Open the chest and push yourself over. Ah, oh, yes. Stretch your arms up. Other elbow, pull back. Reach over. Open up the side. Open everything up. Awesome. Now, take the left shoulder. Drop it. Pull it under your chest. Make sure your shoulders aren't up like this. Drop it. Then pull it under, right? Feel free to rotate your palms so you can get to stretch to move. Excellent. Come around to the front. I want you to round your upper back, curl. Don't let upper back, just curl. And then take a roll so your right arm's on top, grab it, pull it. Woo! Did that ever feel good, yes? Yeah? And come to the top, then come to the middle again, and pull the other arm, pull over on the left. You're pulling your left arm towards the right. Feeling the stretch upper, all the way up and down, your lats, your back, and hips. Come back to that center, all the way up. Open up to goal pose, I know, no, I know, so 
bummed about no Hawkeye football, but I want everybody to be safe. Place your fingers, open up your chest, guys. Wiggle those fingers a little more. Awesome, I'm gonna stop our music. So I hope you guys, I hope it was fun. Hey, Karen, woo! I love when you guys are on with me. I love, love, love it. It's so fun, right? It's more fun with you all. So much more fun. And so, you guys, I have um, a new ebook that I have written. And if you would like a copy of it, please message me your email if I don't already have it. Um, message me on Facebook, your email address, or text it to me um, on my phone. And I will send you a copy of my ebook for free. It's free. So enjoy the rest of your Sunday. And guys, I love you. See you later.